Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Harrison Central. Today is Wednesday, September 28th. I'm Heath with your morning news. There are a few announcements today. There will be academic challenge practice next Tuesday after school until 3.30. If you want to participate and can't make it, please message Ms. Shaw in Google Classroom or email her. The Harco House of Horrors in Jewett is looking for volunteers this year. They need help every Friday and Saturday night in October. If you want to help, contact Tammy Dre at 740-491-7807. The following colleges will be in the cafeteria during high school lunches. Wednesday, October 12th, Ohio University Eastern. Tuesday, October 25th, Youngstown State University. And Thursday, November 3rd, West Liberty University. Now let's send it to Drake for the weather forecast. All right, thank you, Heath. Let's take a look at today's weather forecast. We have a lot of fog in the early morning here on top of the hill at Harrison Central. We're going to see a high temperature of 57, a low of 41. It's about mid to high 40s right now at the time you're watching this. Uh, we got a slight chance of thunderstorms towards the end of the school day. Watch out for those. Uh, but after that, those dark clouds are going to probably move away, and we'll have a little extra sunshine here uh, heading into Thursday morning. That's a look at today's weather forecast. Let's check in with Shay to see what... It's for lunch today. For lunch today, the cafeteria is serving a popcorn chicken bowl with fresh sliced bread, creamy mashed potatoes, golden corn, and orange craisins. For today's teacher feature, we're interviewing Coach Foldy. So what are you teaching this year? Uh, first grade intervention. And what are you most excited for for this school year? Um, I'm excited for the basketball season and also just continuing to teach uh, younger students how to read and develop. And what are your goals for this, for this year's um, boys basketball season as head coach? I think um, one thing that we built on this summer was culture and um, developing a family atmosphere. Um, we have great leadership and three seniors, uh, Cabot Arbal, Jace Madzai, and um, Kane Jarosko. Then also guys that played since their um, freshman year like Hayden Cassidy and Q who are coming back and played at the varsity level. So I think leadership is going to be important this year, building that culture and having that family atmosphere. Thank you. You're welcome. Now listen to Mia with today's history. Thanks, Emma. On this day in history, September 28, 2008, Falcon 1 became the first privately developed, fully liquid-fueled launch vehicle to go into orbit around the Earth. This project's launch cost was estimated around $7 million. SpaceX, an American spacecraft manufacturer, space launch provider, and satellite communications corporation, headquartered in California, funded by Elon Musk. This was the fourth attempt and first successful attempt on the first orbit around Earth for SpaceX. Thanks for watching your morning news. Have a great day and go Huskies. <laughs>